this is porticula and this is moss rose these plants can be easily grown by cuttings during the rainy season see i have planted them last week and they are growing pretty well still i didn't see any flowering started in these flowers but hopefully they will and this is moss rose there's a small bud in this so these plants can be easily grow by cuttings this is hibiscus hibiscus also you can grow by cuttings if you put them during the rainy season you can grow them very easily without any effort so try putting one of hibiscus also in your garden during the rainy season this is arabian jasmine plant which i brought just a cutting so now they are growing so well and this is another plant which you can easily grow by cuttings during the rainy season see they are growing so well and it also started to flowering so these plants jasmine plants can be easily grow by cuttings you can either pot them or ground them and give them good compost and fertilizer too and uh, they will do well during the rainy season Exora is another plant which you can easily grow by cuttings. They bloom very beautifully. So during the rainy season their growth is amazing. They love the bright sunlight though, but during the rainy season their growth is really well. This is Aparajita plant or rather we call it uh, butterfly pea. This is also easily can be grown by cuttings, especially during the rainy season. This plant is about one month old, which I have uh, very easily grown by cuttings. And during this rainy season, it's growing so well as you can see. So I hope this will flower soon too. So that is another plant during the rainy season you can easily grow from cuttings and this is also can be grown by seeds as well. Amanda plants too you can grow by cuttings very easily and you can propagate them in water too and you can ground them. During the rainy season they are really very fast growing. This is my Alamanda plant and there is another one over here in this pot also. This is also growing from cuttings. Spider plants too can be grown by cuttings. So as you have already known from my videos, you can use the spiderets, put them to propagate them in water and after them, after that you can easily ground them or pot them and grow them by cuttings. So these plants also do well during the rainy season. Spider plants does not like the too much of water so you will have to keep them aside or in a shady area because you know, too much over watering will kill the plant so do not leave them in too much of rain. Give them a little bit at least about 30 minutes to 45 minutes will be enough. The rain water is very beneficial but don't overdo that. So keep it in a shady area that will be uh, good for the plant. So in my uh, today's video the last one is lucky bamboo. So these plants are really very easy to grow from cuttings. Rainy season they are one of the best seasons to grow these uh, plants from cuttings. So I hope you find this video really very useful and informative. Please do comment, like and share this video with your friends and family. If you are new consider subscribing to Tamara's garden. See you soon with another video. Bye.